it's coming to that time of year when we're uh, we're all scratching for catch the odd fish here and there. Uh, it's now mid-November, and what I'm doing is altering my uh, tactics slightly to try and attract the odd carp or get the odd carp on the bank. Um, one of the ways I do this is by uh, fishing fairly slack lines, but I need the maximum amount of indication possible to detect any drop backs or the slightest run. To do this, I use the uh, stow bobbins, uh, which if there's the slightest movement on the line, you get an indication, and also it indicates the drop backs very easily as well. I have the main line as slack as possible so that uh, it enters the water more or less uh, straight off the rod and um, I'm only fishing about 40 yards out at the moment but I would say the last 10 to 15 yards is definitely on the bottom of the lake. The setup that I'm using is a semi-fixed lead setup which gives easy release of the lead if I get, in, uh, get a problem of any sort. So if uh, for any reason I get a snag, the lead just floats off. Um, let's put that back on. Now the hook link is, this one's around about uh, four inches long. It's on a figure of eight knot. So it's easily exchanged or removed and I've got a size 4 rocker at the moment but as winter gets in a bit, a bit more I'll drop that down to a size 6 on there are two 10mm boilies just two 10mm boilies and uh, got a barbel suck on with a bit of a kickback this is the um, ultimate barbel suck rig where I'm using today I've had nothing at all haven't had a bite but I'm fishing single loop baits. Uh, I am casting one of them around on a regular basis, keeping two on an area that I uh, put some bait out yesterday. I did a couple of hours yesterday and as I was leaving I probably dropped in about four spawns of bait and I'm fishing over the top of that. Uh, I haven't put any bait out yet because of the uh, problem we have with the coots and the clarity of the water. It's very clear the water. Now the idea of fishing shore tooth links is that uh, especially on a, a fixed lead system, a semi-fixed lead system, is that as the fish picks picks up the bait, it hasn't got very far to travel before it actually makes some indication on the uh, on your end, on the indicators, the stow indicators. The problem with long hook links or with running leads is that uh, the fish can say take a take a bait three four foot on on occasions and there's no indication whatsoever on your end plus uh, you don't get any drop back indication the way that I've got this set up I do get uh, drop backs indicated and also the slightest run whatsoever and again indication very good setup and it catches a lot of fish the only other thing to uh, complement the way that I'm fishing at the moment is obviously it's winter and we do need a good bait. Now the bait that I'm using is the uh, Quality Baits HD or Seasons. Uh, this is a uh, totally uh, fish meal free and oil free bait. Uh, very pleasant smelling, not over flavoured at all and it's a new bait that Jim Kelly and myself have put together and uh, up to yet it's caught a lot of fish.